Okay, welcome back to American Truck Simulator. The last uh, we left off, we had to get shipped back or towed back to Billings. So we're going to be working out of Billings because we had gotten stopped by that train. That truck got stuck in the cross. So as you can see, we are back in Billings. So let's well, just a little outside of Billings. Um, let's see, where are some of the places we haven't been? Sheridan, we haven't been up here. Thompson Falls, Missoula. Let's see what we got. Lauren, Montana, Montana. Great Falls. Been there. I'm trying to find somewhere we haven't been. Another Cody. So late. Spokane, Washington. Don't definitely don't want to go all the way over there. There we go. Um, I think this is probably about where we were heading. Where is that? Oh, that's that would take us over that way. But I've it doesn't really show that as a town, does it? Oh, it's right there. Okay, so we have been there. Uh, let's see. Yeah, that looks like what we're going to do. Yep, there we go. <coughs> so we're going to have to drive into Billings to pick up the load. Hopefully this, uh, this session will be a little bit better than the last. Even though the last one, even though it was a one thing after another it got more views than all the other videos I've put out so I guess uh, that's a plus okay let's see where are we at I think we should be at our shop oh I guess we're not because we had to have some repairs done so oh well okay let's find our way over to the pick up point. I did add a new mod uh, before starting today. The longer trains. It's supposed to be able to have like half mile trains and improved train sounds. So we'll see if we can come across any of those as we're on our our journey. sure exactly how far away from the pickup point we are right now. Yeah, we're almost at a, uh oh, okay. oh, stop sign. <laughs> Didn't see that. I was paying attention to my gas gauge for a second there. We're going to stop and fill up. before I get a trailer hooked up. Got a mod for the gas filling sounds also. Yes, yeah, that's pretty cool. It sounds like a. Getting in the car. Whoops. I had. I switched the buttons from the wipers to the start for a different game. So now it's, um, I just, that's why I turned the wipers on accident, because it was pushing the button that used to be the start button. Okay, no more bad driving. <laughs> Even though bad 
bad driving, like I said, got me more views. But I got the point of the game is kind of for realism, so I want to make sure that it's uh, not getting into accident, which I probably, for more realism, I should probably turn on the uh, penalties. So for like running stoplights and stop signs and getting into accidents and speeding and things like that. But I kind of like the, you know, because you can't, I don't drive bad and stuff like that in the real world. So it gives, it gives you the opportunity to blow some steam once in a while if you get frustrated. Can't do it in the real world. So it's nice to have the game to kind of blow off some steam if you want. If you get a bad driver around you, it irritates you. something with the f with the fair maybe it's one of the rides or something because it seems like whenever I come in this area there's always a siren going and I don't see any police going by with their lights flashing so it must be this fair to the pickup spot. I don't know if that's if it's morning or afternoon. I which direction I'm facing right now. And I'm not sure what time it is because I don't see a clock. safe spot to pull off. You should be able to stop and sleep there. I 
should look into that. I don't know if there's a mod out there that kind of unlocks all roads. So if I wanted to take a, a run down a side road, I could do it. Okay. was going to try putting my window down whenever I went to put my head out the head, put my head out there but yesterday my joystick on my control pad I built was kind of acting funky when I was trying to play Pac-Man so it was making it just kind of continuously go so I'm not really going to touch it so we'll just pretend like I put my window down when I put my head out there because <laughs> I don't want to glitch something out and just like spoil the whole rest of the game turned into the wrong driveway and stuff. I've had my actual GPS in the real world take me down the wrong roads. Like, uh, going back to Illinois from home here, it took us down a road to get us out to the highway. Well, we went down that road and it was a dead end. So it's like, okay, um, thanks. <laughs> Yeah, not too often I seem to catch those things. Yeah, some tells me it's dusk. It's not getting lighter, it seems to be getting a little darker, so. Yeah, we are definitely on the outskirts of Billings. Now we're heading through downtown. Looks like my shop should be around here somewhere. Oh, another green arrow. You 
got a chance to check out my the baby chipmunk video. Oh, it's on my page. I posted it last night. They are so cute. Oh, the mother's got her her hole right next to the fence post and the sidewalk. And it looks like she has three. At least that's what I saw. It was three at a time. Could have one could have been down in the hole when the other three were up, but from what I saw, it looked like just three of them, but they're so cute. If you get a chance, go check that video out. Let me know what you think. Oh yeah, definitely dusk. Get some lights on here. I'm loving this board, man. It's like, the, I always had a hard time Remembering what I set the lights up on my on the steering wheel itself, but now it's it's right there on the panel. Oh, there's that way side way station, but they're letting me bypass it, so that's good.
I've had times where coming up from down in Illinois where you, you could set, I would go for hours where I wouldn't even touch any pedals, I'd just set the cruise control and it just hit goes. Deer 
Hunter 2005 was pretty good. But other than that, most of them, oh, a trophy hunter. I'm trying to think of all the ones. There's just, I've got them up on the shelf, all the discs, all the different games that, well, now I can't even play them because I don't have a CD-ROM in my computer anymore. So if I want to play them, which based on when I bought them to, to now, I could probably get the same games on Steam if they offer them for like a quarter of the price of what I paid for them on disc. It's kind of like uh, Empire of War, Star Wars Empire of War. That one I remember playing the demo for the first time and I was just like blown away. I didn't have a computer that could really play it, so I was at my brother's and he was in college at the time. And I went up to his dorm and was playing it on his computer because I had the demo on the PC Gamer disc. I don't know if you remember that um, back when you know you, you get by the by the magazine. And it came with the da uh, disc with all the demos and, and things like that on it. And I was playing it on that, just waiting for the game to come out. I got it in expansions and stuff, but then um, before I upgraded my computer, I still had a CD-ROM. Well, it wouldn't work for some reason. I downloaded, updated everything, it just would not function. It would, it would crash my computer and stuff, even upgraded. So I ended up getting it on Steam, and now it works fine. It was just something, for some reason, the disc version of the game just wouldn't work. But the Steam version did.
Oh, here we go. Now they want us to stop at the wayside. The way station. So with fishing out of it. It's just with the mosquitoes around here right now, it just kills the desire to be outside. Because it's like a fight. And I don't like to put on mosquito dope. I do, it makes me feel sick, so I'd rather not. Previous trains were like four or 
or five cars. And how often do you see a four or five car train? Which, for me, that's never, especially when I get stopped by it. <laughs> it's always the quarter mile or the half mile train. I'll try one of those. Let me know if you something you'd want to kind of see. Do a little bit harder reversing. gallons world contracts ah, I never really looked, sound, looked at that 129 contracts I've done through the world of trucks contracts completed long distance delivery bonus 6th rank $399 
Okay, end this video right here. I'm going to keep going. I'm going to make another delivery before I sign off on recording this morning. So I'll be putting this next video out the next day. So Okay, well, thank you so much for watching. I greatly appreciate it. Remember to smash that like button. Don't forget to comment down below what you think, and I will talk to you later.